Hey, it's Jared Merlin, and welcome to my YouTube channel. And this is my Minecraft Second World. It's titled Earth 2. And I just wanted to show you guys the progress that I've made here. Alright, so this um, village was abandoned. And I basically put it all back together. It had all kinds of cobwebs and stuff like that, missing windows, broken roofs, and I fixed everything. And here is where the um, table, furnace, chest, and this is just a shack. It's not really anything special right now. Um, I fixed all of this out here. And the bell over here is actually on the ground. I know there's got to be a way to put them with these posts, but I haven't figured that out yet. I tried doing it, but it wouldn't work, so I just put it on that. Um, I still got to move all this in. I got all that. I'm still gonna fixing those down there. And um, the fountains, the waterfalls, I'm sorry. I put the rock here instead of just letting it come down. And just that It looked boring. So the rock is sort of like keeping it in and keeping the pooling over there. And um, I added some wooden steps here. I built some steps up into the um, rest of the village up there, uh, as you can see. And of course, added some torches, some fences, wheat. <laughs> and these actually have stuff in them. Uh, take care of, you know, seeds, product, another table. And uh, this is where the, whoever's going to be here, you know, the villagers, take care of the place to do all the uh, crops and stuff like that. Um, this is all wheat stuff, but I'm not going to need this anymore. Um, over here, I got melons and pumpkins. So, watermelons and the pumpkins. Um, Sugar cane, which I'm growing because I'm almost done with my, um, what do you call it, table. There's more melons and stuff. And yeah, see, I figured out how to make the lights here with the four torches. My warehouse is complete for now. If I have to add another floor, I will. Um, I fixed these two places up, too. Uh, these have cartography tables in them. Um, so if I get villagers, you know, there's two of them. They can be cartographers together, so. And the places are all fixed up. Um, this is where I'm going to turn that hay, the, the, I'm sorry, the weed over there. I'm going to take that out and put uh, sheep in there. I got beetroot here growing and over there and wheat and um, my little campfire. I built it. The, this is my place here. Uh, just good for my size right now. Yeah. So, oh yeah, let me take a look at my chest for you. Um, as you can see, I got enough iron stuff. I found this bottle of enchanting. I haven't used it yet because I don't even know what it's for. No, it's got to be some kind of enchantment. And then I found this in my travels for the jungle. I got a whole bunch of gold stuff, lapis lazuli, redstone. Um, I got an additional compass while I was out there searching. And uh, my diamond pickaxe so I can get the obsidian so I can make my um, the chanting table. So, yeah, I've been pretty busy. Close this door. Come take a look. And I just did this today. I got the chickens and chicks and the cows and the baby cow. And yeah, the cows I'm going to need because um, I still need five bookcases to complete this. Um, right in here. I got that. It's all set, but I still need the five books before I can do any enchanting. All right. So now the other thing, um, I don't know if or when I'm going to need it, but I just thought it might be cool to have both of them. Sort of like a heaven or hell thing, you know. <laughs> um, water here, lava here. So, um, yeah. 
the uh, village is looking pretty good. And um, I've managed to kidnap some animals. Now the next thing I got to do, I got to learn how to get villages here because there are some villages I've been to that I know I can take people from and get them here because I want to I wanna get villagers in this place. I mean, I'm fixing it up still, but I want to get it running, you know, have the villagers work this. Um, I really, I'm so glad it, it came out the way that it did. I mean, it looks halfway decent, I think. So, yeah. And there's the mountain up there. Oh, yeah. I want to take you down there and take a look. Um, I found diamonds, believe it or not, at minus 16 level. And I was shocked because I know that the videos that I took a look at on YouTube said that you can find diamonds between minus 53 and minus 58, but I found them at minus 16. So I was a little shocked. I'm like, wow, okay. So far, this is the only mine that has worked out for me, believe it or not. Every other mine I've gone into is flooded. So, yeah, it's going to take just a little bit, but I just wanted to show you. This is what happened. I got down to this level, and I haven't gone down there yet. It's kind of scary looking. But I did go this way. And, uh, yeah, it's <laughs> I made it safe and accessible so that I don't kill myself. Because, of course, if you take a look down there, yeah, darkness. So I just took my time, made it accessible and easy so I don't fall and kill myself. And, um, yeah, this is where... I went down, so I'll show you. Right about here. Um, let me see. Yeah, see? Minus 16. This is where I found the diamonds on this side here. So that's why I have got those two ways. I'm going to see if I can find some more. But um, like I said, I'm trying to get down to minus 53, minus 58. And um, yeah, let's see this. Let me put a torch here. Okay. Let's see what level this is at. All right, this is minus 40, so I'm almost there. And um, I'll definitely let you guys know if I, I find any more diamonds. I'm, hopefully this time I can record it for you guys. Um, I, I did a lot of work today. This would have like been like three, four, five-hour video. And I said, no, nah, I'm not doing that. So I just figured I'd just do what I can do and uh, take you guys on a tour just to show you, you know, what I've been up to. So I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, where am I? And I gotta be careful. There we go. I'm usually not good memory-wise with stuff, so that's why I, I I made those steps and you know put the torches to lead the way because don't ask me to remember which way I went because I have bad memory when it comes to stuff. It's like, did I go down this tunnel? Did I go down that tunnel? This way, I let myself know. But yeah, like I said, this is the only mine in this uh, world that actually panned out for me. Everything else has just been flooded and flooded and flooded. and I mean, I'm surrounded by water, so. But this one actually worked out. That one up there actually went, I ended up in lava. And um, I was just like, yeah, okay, that's not going to do it. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do with these out here yet. Um, I still got to fix all this. You know, all this was crops, but I don't want crops there anymore. I don't know what I'm going to do with these places. Um, this one, yeah, that's already got something. Repair and disenchant, so I'll get someone to do that. Um, like I said, there's villagers out there somewhere that I can... I just need to find out how to kidnap them and bring them here. But, uh, yeah, I still have this place to fix up here. i got to take care and get rid of all these melons here. I still have to fix these places. They're all broken you know some beds left inside <laughs> holes in the roof so yeah i'm almost done with this village i got a lot done but it's just still yeah so i just wanted to take a yeah show you guys um, give you guys a look at the village and what i did with it i'm pretty pleased with it and i it was a lot of work i i wasn't sure whether i wanted to do it or not but it, it's just i'm glad that i did I really am because look at it. I think it came out fantastic. So, 
And I'm still going to bet on the play, so I'll definitely let you guys know. All right. So, take it easy.